Hello guys, today I am back with a Zara haul. We all love a Zara haul. This isn't just one order. I have been in the store. I've been having a little mooch online. We're at that spring summer transitional season where you kind of want to dress for spring summer and today it's actually gorgeous and you could be wearing your mini skirts and your little shorts but most of the time it's still raining so we're trying to find the balance and I've been picking up like little golden pieces. I feel like I've got some gorgeous bits in this haul and bits that you will love. As always, I will leave the codes and the links below if you want to shop something. Also, this uh, little like cardigan, it's like a little zip up cardigan that I am wearing. This is from Topshop on ASOS. I'll link it below and the little vest top underneath. This is from Zara. I guess we'll start with this. This is my first Zara piece. I'll put a cutaway on the screen of it. I am a sucker for a white vest top like me on white vest tops wear like this because I just can't have enough of them in my wardrobe. I feel like they are the easiest piece to wear in style. The black trousers I'm wearing, they're also from Zara and I just feel like a white top, a black bottom as your base under anything looks really well, works really well and is so, so easy. So a lot of the bits today, I didn't style up the way I would maybe wear them when I go to wear them but I did just pop them on top of this base because it worked and it was easy. And this is just a bit of a try on haul, not a styling haul. So I hope that's okay with you. Let's get into the rest of this box. Okay, so I'm not really sure where to start, but I'm just gonna pull this piece because I have been on the fence about waistcoats for about a month or so. And I knew I liked it. I just didn't know if it would work on me, but this one was only $29.99 and I thought, you know what, let's try it. I actually think this would be so nice dressed up on a night out with nothing underneath it. I've tried it on like that for you. I'll pop it here or here, we'll figure that out. Yeah, I have seen these all over Pinterest, all over Instagram, and I feel like it's so cool. It's very androgynous, which is the style that I love as well. And I feel like with these trousers I'm wearing, maybe a white shirt underneath, maybe nothing underneath, maybe a t-shirt underneath, open, that could be a look. Now I know this won't be for everyone. Also, I picked that up in a size small. I saw this in store and I just looked at it and I knew that if I wanted it to be fitted, I needed to go for the small. Um, if I'd been shopping online, I probably would have picked up a medium because I always do. But I have to say, at the moment, I am finding Zara sizing is worse than ever before. Like, you just don't know what you're gonna get at the moment. These cuffs are anthropology, aren't they stunning? I've got an M for me and an S for Scott. I think they're so cute. Okay, then we've got what I think is the piece de resistance of this haul. Honestly, I know so many of you are gonna love this. I wore this sitting on this sofa with 100K balloons um, for my Instagram. I reached 100K followers on Instagram, which was such a huge, incredible milestone for me. I feel like for years and years and years, I set myself all these goals and then I like to set an unrealistic goal as well. And I always said that 100K was the out of reach one and the one that I felt would never happen. So when it did happen, I was so, so, so excited. And my boyfriend came home with um, 100K balloons. So I had to get a wee picture. So I wore this. I was so happy. I bought it. I absolutely love it. Mini skirts are everywhere this season. Um, but what I love about this is it's a little skirt. Now I wouldn't be a big fan of my legs, but you feel totally secure. Like when I'm wearing a skirt, I'm always, you know, pulling down on it. But when you've got shorts, it's just so much more comfortable. So this is super cute. I got the shorts and the blazer in a medium. I do not think a small would work on me. I have bigger thighs, but then this is just kind of not tight around the waist. So I don't know. I think I definitely went for the right sizing. I have to say the quality of this cohort is insane. It's so, so thick. And I just love the color, like color in my wardrobe. It's so nice to see. And this is that kind of, oh, what's the word for it? It's not duck egg blue. That's so annoying. I can't remember. Does it begin with a P? Something blue. Periwinkle, periwinkle blue. Um, that's what I think it is. I love it. If you are on the fence about this, just do it, just do it. Okay, then we've got a simple little black top. And the reason I was kind of drawn to this is I'm loving the corset vibes absolutely everywhere, but 
for me having a little bit of a fuller chest, I always feel more secure if I'm wearing a bra. So I noticed that the whole back of this was kind of like completely covered, if you get what I mean. You know, it didn't come down low, so there's no kind of worry about your bra strap being on show. These are the things that I think about, and if you have a filler chest, you'll totally be on my level about this. It's gorgeous. It's like a sweetheart kind of neckline. I've covered it in deodorant, putting it on because it is tight, but it's tight in a good way. It's exactly how I wanted it to fit. $17.99, I got size medium. Really like it, not a lot to say. It is just a plain black top, but these are so handy to keep in your wardrobe if you are going on a last minute night out or you're going for drinks um, or something like that. So really like this one. Then we've got this piece. I ordered this because I thought this was just the perfect transitional piece from winter to spring, summer. It's a really thick blazer, but obviously it's a waistcoat because it doesn't have sleeves. We all know how much I love a blazer. So I haven't fully figured out the styling of this. I've got one outfit in mind, but I want to be able to wear it more than one way. So I'm gonna work on this. If you've got any styling ideas for this, do let me know, but um, I am gonna keep it. It's lovely quality, really thick. And I think this was 30 pounds. Yeah, 29.99 and I went for the size medium large. I just like everything oversized. It's got really nice gold buttons on it as well. I think that detail makes it look super expensive and I do think this is just a really lovely piece. So it will be linked below. Okay, then we've got a dress and I need your honest, honest opinions on this because I love it. I, I really love it, but I just don't know if I love it on me and I will tell you why. This is a little white dress. It goes across the neck like this. You've got a little sleeve here. It's got this lovely cutout, um, and like I said, a sleeve on this side, and it's just stunning. The detail, everything's lovely. It was only $29.99. I got a size medium, but I feel like on me, I always kind of go for dresses that at least snip in at the waist because I always feel that my chest can make things sit out and then it just kind of looks like a tent on me. So I don't know, like I really like it. I think this would be amazing for a bride on her hen or out for like a hen dinner. I think that would be fab. It's just so nice and you know how I feel about white in the summer, but I'm not sure if it's amazing on me. I'm not sure if it flatters me. I, I don't know. So let me know. I will put the cutaway on the screen and you can tell me if I should keep it or return it. Your opinions are important on this one, please. Okay, we've got another dress and I honestly think this is the most stunning dress I've ever seen, but I feel a little heartbroken over this piece. And I was kind of wondering why this dress wasn't viral on social media. Like the other pink dress from Zara, it's more of a baby pink and it kind of like has that boning across the chest. But I've now realized why, because the fit of this dress is just so off. Sorry, the sizing of this dress is just the most bizarre, random, inaccurate sizing of any Zara piece I've ever worn. So much so that I bought it in three sizes. I originally ordered this in the medium because I just saw that it was one of those little corset ones and I thought, gosh, I don't think I'd fit into a small. The medium was humongous, like literally, it didn't even cinch in around my waist. It was just, you know, straight up and down. So I was like, that is so big. I'm gonna have to order the extra small. I've never been extra small in anything in my life. I'm not an extra small, but as we know, Zara sizing. So I ordered the extra small and the small as a backup. I will pop a clip of the small on. If I'm gonna keep any, I'm gonna keep the small because the extra small just is too small. It's too tight up here. It's too tight on my hips. The material ruches. I'll pop the extra small on the screen as well so you can see the difference. But I don't know. I just feel like this dress just doesn't fit like any size. Maybe it's just my body. I don't know. But it's such a beautiful dress and it's just such a shame because I just feel like it could be so much better and it's just not if this fitted perfectly, I have a wedding in Italy in the summer and I would be saving this for it. But I feel like I need to go back to the drawing board because as beautiful as this is, I don't think I'd be comfortable in it all day because as I said, it just doesn't fit right. It's $49.99 for reference, which I think is the perfect price because it does have lots of gorgeous detail. Like you'll see the boning and it's got that extra layer where it coils so you're not revealing too much. So a really great price. If you can make this look amazing, 
honestly send me pictures i'll be so jealous but i want to see so send me um an insta dm and show me my camera battery died but i've only got one thing left to show you and i actually nearly forgot about this because it's already hung up in my wardrobe because i have already worn this the tags are off and when i say the tags are off the string is still on because i can never get that off i mean i could just use scissors but you know, I never do. But I am obsessed with this set. I have worn it. I haven't really got a photo in it though. This reminds me so much of my Fourth and Reckless set. It was cream. I got it last year. I cannot wait to bring it back out this year. It's just so stunning and so versatile. I wore it, you know, with trainers, with heels. I wore it as a bikini cover up and I intend to do the same with this. In fact, it was St. Patrick's Day this week and I really should have worn this, but I actually didn't go anywhere because I was working in the evening. So I didn't get to go out and have a wee drink, but if I did, I would 100% have worn this. So yeah, it's got a little button up, but you'll see in the cutaway, I kind of styled it tied up. Um, when I did wear it, I wore it to an event and I wore it open with a little top underneath it. There's so many ways you can wear it and you can mix and match, wear the top with jeans and wear the trousers with you know a different top. I will say I am five foot three. The trousers are so long. I'm sort of thinking I could just cut the ends off them because that is a really thin kind of end. And even if it wasn't straight, you definitely wouldn't notice. And I'm gonna be honest, I probably will just cut them because you won't notice, I don't think. And it doesn't look like the kind of material that will fray. So that's probably what I'm gonna do from memory. This was $25.99 for the top and $25.99 for the trousers. I think that's a really good price for such, you know, a versatile piece that you can wear so many different ways. And I really love it. So I hope it's still in stock. It's such a fab color. And you'll have noticed, as I said, there's as much color in this haul as there is neutrals, which is very unusual for me. But we are embracing color this spring, summer. We have to, it's gonna be everywhere. So yeah. That is everything that I got. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite piece is and let me know what I should do about that white dress because as I said, I am a little bit torn on it. Um, everything will be linked below, as I said, and I'll leave codes if things have gone out of stock and therefore can't be linked, but you'll be able to get them below. And if not, I will link similars for you as well. If you are new here, I'd love it so much if you subscribed, give the video a thumbs up and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.